Commander, I see you have purchased the necessary party supplies. When you are ready, you can send invitations from your private terminal. What sort of party are you hoping to have tonight, Commander? Let's keep things relaxed. Certainly, Commander. I'll ensure music remains at an appropriate volume and arrange for some refreshments. I will also modify my appearance to be more festive. Hey, come on in. Thanks for coming. Thanks for the invite. Make yourselves at home. Thank you. Happy to be here, Shepard. Yeah, thanks for coming. Wait, 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 wait. Relax, it's a party. I can't get over the size of this apartment. The electric bill alone could have paid for my college tuition. So, Shepard, keeping the hard liquor under lock and key? Otherwise, I'd have to drive you all home. Are we sure the Normandy is still there? Has anyone else tried to steal it? Stealing the Normandy? Now there's an idea. Wait, what? Who? Trainer, you still have your toothbrush? We can always get another Normandy. Call up Cerberus and ask them to please build us the SR3. But wouldn't that require you to change your name? Tali Zora von Normandy SR3. It's Voss Normandy. Even I get confused by Quarian names sometimes. We've seen a lot of good times with you. <laughs> nice ink. But you got a long way to go to catch up. Nah, I just got this one. I lost my squad a few years ago. Hey, what's the story behind that? And how far down does it go? Tactful, as always. What? I'm just wondering. I like tattoos. Hey, Shepard. Yes. You gonna have a drink? Sure. How's everyone doing? Great so far. <laughs> this is really nice. It's very soothing. So what happened after that? It's great. Quiet. After the excitement of the mission, it's a good quiet, right? Seriously? We could ramp it up a little, Shepard. Relax. The night is young. <laughs> I like it like this. You got it, boss. I'm just happy to be kicking back. Haven't seen him since. <laughs> that reminds me, I heard you're going to be a father. Congratulations. Yeah, thanks. Be lying if I said I wasn't scared. You'll do great. You're a protector. That goes a long way. Well, look who's here. You know, I miss the days when Cerberus was just hilariously incompetent. You know, when you two ran things. Excuse me? <laughs> the only thing I was in charge of was the Lazarus Project, which, you will note, was very successful. Hey, Commander, this is Cerberus. We were studying some rachni, and they got loose and killed all our guys. Can you take care of that? It's one system over from where we hooked some guy up to the Geth, who then got loose and killed all our guys. They did rack up quite a body count. At least back then, it was usually their own bodies. We knew some cells were bad, but the Alliance and the Council weren't doing anything. And we were doing good work. And crunches. Well, Lots of crunches. Hey, not okay, Kasumi. But we did bring Commander Shepard back. And after taking down the Collectors, I cut ties with Cerberus, got loose, and started killing all their guys. For which we thank you. I have no idea Jeff, do you remember that I am also a Cerberus project? Oh, crap. <laughs> Blasto is pretty awesome. You people watching tonight, Edie? Isn't that how it always goes? Hey, Commander. Weird to see everybody here together. You think? Well, weird, but good. Nice to know it's not always arm wrestling reapers with us. Anyway, thanks for putting it together. Thanks for inviting me, Shepard. It's nice to see you like this.
I must admit. My turn. Uh, I've thought about it. <laughs> I could go for a few more of these. Okay, I... <laughs> Hello, Commander. Kids are good. Kicking ass. Hi. I'm trying to socialize. Would you like me to keep everything at its current intensity? I'd rather things didn't get too crazy. Excellent decision. Drink! I'm drinking! But it's not a drinking game. Protheans can read the smallest details of our environment. Your point is valid. Let's talk before I... So... Edie said you found her voice attractive. <laughs> not enjoying the party, Samara? Oh yes, Shepard. I am. Although not in the same way as the others, perhaps. Are you worried about me? Don't be. I only stepped away for a moment to use the restroom, and then I found this quiet corner. Reflecting on one's place in the universe while a party rages within reach can feel oddly self-affirming. Meditating isn't often considered party behavior. Perhaps. I don't attend many parties, to be honest. Wait. Are you two arguing over Edie? No! Probably not. Okay, you know she smashed my head against the side of a shuttle? I know! Twice! I heard it from Liara! That was like forever ago. Plus it wasn't Edie back then. Did you see it's that? really unfair of you to even bring it up. Yeah, what the hell was I thinking? Probably just brain damage making me touchy. Apology accepted. You know, it's not healthy to just bottle these things up. The hell is up? Oh, still creepy, Kasumi. What? No, I'm not even buzzed yet. I do recall running into you once or twice in the shower. Look, Shepard, there's no easy way to say this, which is why it's fortunate I'm pretty hammered right now. Trainer has a thing for robots. Wanker. I mean, the tech background. Uh, this place is a goddamn joke. Sight lines aren't bad. Check One out. point in its favor, and I'm supposed to be impressed. And what the hell is this supposed to Not if I can help it. <laughs> Edie, what can I get you? Anything? Let me get you something. That is not necessary, Steve. I can't tell if you're having a good time. I am observing displays of complex social entropy. So yes, I am having a good time. Commander! Javik? Apologies. I have been drinking the provided drinks. Sure. Uh, you might want to tap the brakes a little. Everyone having a good time? Will there be food available soon? You're hungry, Edie? I'm just glad to no. Oh, thank you. However, my research oh, suggests no that serving intoxicants without nourishment is considered unwise. I can eat. In my cycle, we had food. Many of varieties. You feeling okay? I am Prothean. I never feel okay. Though this drink is changing that. When did that happen? Mm. Know what I could go for? Fish and chips. Greasy, salty, crispy, flaky, melt in your mouth. Yes, that. Let's get that. Shall I arrange some fish and chips, Shepard? Steve, is that your favorite? Actually, I'm a dessert guy. 
My aunt used to make this chocolate lava bomb cake. When I first escaped from Cerberus, I found these chocolate chip cookies at a store. <sighs> Ripped through the whole damn thing. Nothing in this cycle compares to the food of my people. Maybe you should get cooking then, Javik. Most of our ingredients are extinct. Except Krogan. Sorry. Dury. Larry. And Cory. Is there any we could spare? Hope you don't feel left out, Edie. Do not worry. I've been employing a socialization protocol feature that came with this unit. It is called Smile and Nod. Okay, I'll see about arranging more food then. Shepard. Shepard. Grunt? Shepard! Rex? Commander Shepard. Shepard, Shepard, Shepard. Rex? Grunt? Shepard. Shepard. Shepard? Shepard. Grunt? <laughs> Haven't gotten all dressed up in a while. It's nice. Shepard! Do you require anything further? Let's set up a card game in the den. Please let me know if my astronomical calculations appear to be throwing off results of the game. You're bluffing. Don't be so sure. <laughs> oh, I'm telling him that. Commander, can you believe Doc's never played poker? How are the lessons going? The Asari still refuses to take risks. Victory does not come without cost. You're not even playing. Doc's not much of a gambler. Be glad we are not participating in one of the games from my cycle. You would all lose horribly. Aw, oh, be nice to Liara. You're going to have your hands full with me anyway. Adios. How long have you been there? Well, my willingness to gamble aside, this has been a wonderful evening, Shepard. Glad you guys are having fun. It's nice to see people relax and let their guards down. I'll try not to take advantage. Glad Time spent being idle. Do you fear the crew will grow soft, Commander? I think everyone could use the break. This from the Asari who buries herself in studying Protheans day and night. Good to know bickering like an old married couple has not changed since your cycle. Enjoy your game, guys. And I'd keep an eye on Liara if I were you. <laughs> Give me a few more rounds, and you might not have anything left to wager. Now... Is it done yet? The recipe calls for more curry. From now on, we have to keep in touch. I'll give that. You're a great pilot. The best, but go on. All I'm saying is that when it comes to... So, the first Normandy kind of evaporated. <laughs> It was unfortunate, but Shepard did get a better ship out of the deal. I wouldn't fight myself for another ship. Or ever again. No more clones. <laughs> Come on, fighting a clone can't be worse than the Collector base. That was some messed up shit. That place still gives me nightmares. Well, I can't yeah, didn't not something I wish to repeat. I'm glad I wasn't around for that one. We must never fear the fight against evil. I and I had faith that Shepard would see us through. That ability to triumph despite impossible odds is exactly why Shepard was brought back. Hey, did I ever tell you about the time I saved the Normandy single-handed? Yeah, right. It's true. For sure. I was there. I'll vouch for him. Collectors boarded the Normandy. I only had a minute to come up with something to take him down. So you unshackled an AI. Always a good plan. I don't hear anyone complaining about Edie now. Yes, we're all glad she didn't turn out to be an evil robot. <laughs> Weren't you complaining earlier about how she smashed her face yeah, in? We're losing focus. Edie wasn't a robot back then. And when the Collectors took over, she was still shackled. So it was me, saving the Normandy by myself. Single head. Yes, you did. Good man.
So, what games did you play in your cycle? Good question. You don't exactly strike me as Mr. This is nice. I don't spend much time with everyone like this. As friends, I'm glad we could do this. Everybody okay? The entertainment efficiency of the party was falling due to inadequate food supplies. Ouch. Do not be concerned. I am compensating. I just wanted her to heat something up. Now she's cooking. With a vengeance. Edie, I appreciate the help, but parties aren't about efficiency. That looks good. A party is a collective event among like-minded individuals. It requires teamwork and an understanding of group dynamics. You did not pass through the Omega-4 relay to assault the collector base without preparation. Why should this be any different? Because it's a party. Nobody's gonna die if we do it wrong. I'm really hungry, Shepard. But if you were to ask a team member to select the music and you chose Jeff, the results would be disastrous. I would never choose Jeff. Tally, are you okay? Yep. You want to see my tattoo? I don't think you have a tattoo, Tally. It's a hologram. Omni tattoo. Omni tat. Omni two. <laughs> Under the suit. You know, for me. You want to know what it is? You wanna know? It's a pretty bird. Made of rainbows. It is flying out of the eye hole of a skull. Being held in the mouth of a thresher maw with a naked woman holding a sword on its back. I'd heard the stories about the Normandy's crew before, but when you put it all together, defeating rogue specters, facing the collectors, and now the war, it's pretty crazy stuff. Yeah, all things considered, you'd think the Normandy crew would have a much higher turnover rate. This is completely what I needed. Just hanging out, no crazy stuff. You're cleaning me out, Doc. Weren't you the one who... Would you like me to change the intensity of the atmosphere? I think it's time to turn things up a bit. I will arrange for up-tempo music and additional cocktails right away, Commander. <laughs> oh, shot it! <laughs> Worst planet to get shot down over? We're talking pre-war? Pre-war, life-bearing worlds only. Uh, I'm going with Tarif. Garden world, yes, but it's got those chlorine swamps. I will see your Tarif and raise you Azoria, home of Toxic. Hey, guys. Duck and Chop? No worries. This is fun for us. So you don't have a sidearm under your pilot's chair? The weapons locker is on the bridge, practically right there. A weapon you can't get to is no weapon at all. When's the last time you trained with a handgun? <laughs> Sometime before I got the ass-kicking robot as my co-pilot. That's no good. And what if you have to save Edie someday? Unacceptable. You should always trade. Pilots are warriors, too. You know what this is? It's a man emergency. 
take this kid out back and make him do target practice. Exactly. Some range time will fix you up. Right, Commander? You are not taking me shooting. My testosterone levels are plenty high. I fly a deadly war machine, remember? Where's the are. Yes, I will have another. Great party. I better... Reminds me of Cora's den. Have it Absolutely. Biotics are impressive. I'm not saying they aren't. You're just saying that they're not that impressive. I'm not saying anything. I'm just saying... Oh, shit. No, it's fine. Hey, what's going on here? Everyone playing nice? Of course, Shepard. James was just explaining how physical conditioning trumps biotics. <laughs> really? You go in there, James? Commander. Just listen. Biotics are strong, but unpredictable. All that cooling down. Shepard, where did you find this guy? A person can improve their physique, but biotics, they are what they are. He's joking, right, James? I mean, what's your point exactly? Okay, okay, maybe it's not conditioning exactly. Maybe it's just the condition of one James <laughs> Vega. Check it out. This guy here never has to cool down. In fact, the hotter, the better. Hilarious. Just hush and do some sit-ups. Kasumi. Just looking. <laughs> oh, goddess. If I took that the wrong way, it's your fault. <laughs> James, this is a no-brainer. Biotics win, hands down. We're talking about harnessing dark energy here. Yeah, I hear you. Look around you. That had to be an argument you couldn't win. It's okay, man. Yeah, well, you win some, you lose some. Ashley, you couldn't back me up? Back you up because... Okay. More drinks? Snacks? Help yourselves. So, you're leading the Grissom Academy students? Yeah. That a problem? Just a surprise. Your psych profile suggested you were mainly interested in yourself. You're telling me I'm only interested in myself? <laughs> oh, that's just fucking perfect. Did it occur to you that maybe I'm trying to grow as a goddamn person? Oh, I could tell you were growing. I assumed it was whatever that is you're wearing. Oh, these? Well, yeah. They were strapped down with a leather belt before. Ladies, I see we've all gotten enough to drink. Relax, Shepard. I'm not gonna smear the walls with her this time. And I couldn't possibly think of anything worse to do to her than that haircut. Hey, cheerleader. You're fun to hate. You see, Shepard? Best of friends. Honestly, I thought it might help if you two just kissed and got it over with. What? I mean, this is all just sexual tension, right? Two powerful biotics, forceful personalities, confident in their sexuality. You are shitting me. Oh my god. I'm ready to record. I'm pretty sure there's a market for this. Kasumi, I will find you and I will hurt you badly. Ugh. I need another drink. One for me too. No ice. Don't worry, Shepard. The cheerleader and I are just messing around. You sure? You two seem pretty serious. Nah. <laughs> All right, Jack. I hate to say it, but Cerberus was wrong about you. No shit. You're still violent and maladjusted. But the elusive man never would have predicted you'd bond with the Grissom Academy kids. You are growing, despite everything Cerberus did to you. I find that extremely admirable. Wow. You believe it? Thanks. I still really hate you, but you have fantastic tits. <laughs> All right. I can live with that. Blasto is pretty 
Hey, sweetheart. We never really talked about it, but you and me have a lot in common. We do. Of course we do. We're both hunters, right? Hello, Shepard. Zaid was just keeping me company. Hello there. You're admiring the art? Beauty, as they say, is in the eye of the beholder. Hey, Shepard. Hey, beautiful. What do you think, Samara? Hang on, hang on. Don't get all snooty on me. I didn't say I didn't like it. I do like it. What's wrong, you two? I am asking Specialist Trainer about why she found my voice sexually attractive. Oh, shut up. I hadn't even met you yet. This is a really good cheese, Shepard. I put some in through the filters. Is it organic? On one occasion, you said that you wanted to, quote, pin my voice against the wall and run your tongue along its collarbone. Well, there's a context there that... You were talking about quantum entanglement, and I didn't know you were an AI. There's some kind of herb in the cheese that I can't quite place. Is it sage or basil? Anyway, I was just joking. You know, stress of the retrofits and... Exactly. You know what really? My diagnostics suggested that you were genuinely aroused. It's really rare to get herbed dextro cheeses. The Turians almost never bother. You have diagnostics. Cerberus programmed you to check body language. I get more reliable results measuring pupil dilation and thermal readings of erogenous zones. Oh, good lord. Glad you made it. Oh, wait, this is dextro cheese, right? Kila, did I forget to scan the cheese? This is why I don't drink. Fair's fair, trainer. Edie has a right to ask about what you said. Oh, we are going to talk later. I was very interested in trainer's ability to develop sexual feelings for what was, at the time, a bodiless voice. You are all terrible. Edie, I apologize for saying that I wanted to roll naked with your voice in satin sheets. Oh, I was not offended. In fact, it was flattering. Even the part where I wanted to grab your voice by the hair and nibble my way down its back. <laughs> I do not, in fact, remember you saying that, Samantha. Oh, that wasn't out loud. Never mind. Don't mind me. I'm just going to run a toxin treatment. I'm pissed, but I'm not going to let it ruin the party. Or should I say, we are not. Right, Williams? Whoa, leave me out of this, hombre. More drinks, yes? Jacob. Where can I wash my hands? Oh, don't give me that look. I heard there's a big party in there. <laughs> well, that was mortifying. Well, you should see the other guy. He wound up with... Are you serious? So what were your fighters like? <laughs> yeah.
Here's the thing. Occupied. You can't come in either. Stop it. How's it going over here? You can't come in. It's going good. I see that. Anyone interesting trying to get in? Not really. No. Get lost. <laughs> no. You should maybe let me decide that. Huh? Okay, but I'm telling you it's ugly out there. It can't be that bad. Hello? Is this Commander Shepard? Oh my god, oh my god! I can't believe it's you! Runt? Keep up the good work. Will do. I told you already. No! Yes, I like pie. And no. Hey, Shepard, thanks for the invite. We could just talk. We're not gonna hug or anything, are we? <laughs> you wish. Shepard? Did you see that hot tub? Shepard? Glad you came up for air. Hey. I'm just you know, going to sit here when quietly and now? hope someone Which changes the subject. Fortune. Awkward? Awkward. <laughs> You're a wild man or person or whatever. When you were younger, you ever just throw people around for fun? People? You know, people, things, stuff, pets, cars, whatever. Of course not. Oh, yeah. All the time. <laughs> Your guests appear to be enjoying themselves, Commander. What shall I do now? Maybe you should check on your boss. I think she's involved in a competition upstairs. I will locate Dr. Tassoni right away. Help! My glasses are empty! <laughs> Could not. I assure you, Dr. Tassoni is quite capable. You've seen biotics in action. I could float you off this balcony without breaking a sweat. <laughs> Shepard. What's up? Just demonstrating a little biotic supremacy. You okay, James? Yeah, this is trippy. I'm kind of buzzing all over. Exactly. Nice, right? I can feel that way on a whim. Do you find it relaxing? Uh, kinda. Among other things. Looks good on you. I'm glad you lost that bet, James. When's my turn? Careful. I need my full crew back when the night's over. Okay, you've had your fun. Put me down now. Come on, let's dance. Wonderful party, Shepard. I'm pleasantly surprised. Yeah. It's nice, isn't it? Glad you came. Strange to see
myself. I move like a greased one leg. Excellent. Go back to sleep. This is fun. You people are the best. This is the best. I am so waking up on the floor. tomorrow. I didn't want to think about it. Yeah, I'll go. No fights? Really? Come closer and say hey, Shepard. No fights? Really? <laughs> hmm. <laughs> no fights? Really? Yeah, no fights? Really? 
Goddamn kids and their music. Trevor! So here's where the party's at. Goddamn right. Come to hang out with the popular kids, Shepard. Easier to talk back here. I know. What do you think of the music? Great? Bad? What? Not as good as in your cycle, eh, Javik? Am I right? Not even remotely. Knew it. Oh, maybe we can leg wrestle later. Perfect end to a perfect evening. Sure, absolutely. I'll look for you later then, maybe. I got a piss. <laughs> I told Liara that Protheans invented electricity. <laughs> Asari would believe anything. Jeff. Yes, E.D. At social events like this, it is customary to dance with friends or loved ones. Would you dance with me? It's gonna take a lot more than a polite request to make that happen, Edie. I have recordings of you talking in your sleep that would make for a highly amusing extranet video. Okay, that's oh, cheating. What happened after that? Hi. So we won't dance? That's with you, huh? Hello, Shepard. You will not. Well, I will. No. <laughs> those moves more often, trainer. Captain on deck! Has he always been like this? Shepard is saving the galaxy. You have to forgive a few eccentricities. It's very enthusiastic. It is impressive. We should record this and broadcast it for the Reapers. They'll either run away, melt down, or fall in love. <laughs> Good to see some things don't change. Well, I like it, Commander. It's good to see you cut loose now and then. Thank you all for your loyalty and support.
Wow, Edie, you do not mess around with those drinks. I believe you are strong enough to handle it, Jeff. Hey, that's my song! Hey, everyone. Come over here for a minute. Let's get a photo to remember this. Arrange yourselves on the sofa. An excellent suggestion, Shepard. Great idea. I want a copy. Make way. Make way. Thanks for coming, everyone. Here's to us. Ready, Glyph? Of course. If you could all please direct your attention this way. Okay. Everyone say Normandy. Normandy! Who's here? How do you feel? It could be worse. I could be waking up alone. Not on my watch. Good. Come on. Let's see if anyone else is up. 